channel if you have not like and subscribe the channel please like and subscribe the channel and uh, you just have to go to the google and type for search for the alien tag champion and here uh, as uh, you can also uh, search on 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 the youtube as well so since you are already you know this channel is if you are new to this channel this channel is uh, uh, is meant for the technical news uh, related about my endpoint manager or any mobile device management software and if you want to learn something more about apple ios or windows 10 or anything um, related to the os operating system devices website or tech blogs so please don't forget to subscribe <coughs> in this video i'm going to share you how if you are managing uh, your uh, iOS devices, iPad and uh, iOS devices from Microsoft Intune. Uh, how you can uh, and uh, and if your device is supervised through Apple Business Manager or Device Enrollment Program, how you can uh, how you can uh, create the policy to update your devices so that your devices will be fully uh, patched and 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 running and will be running on the latest operating system. Okay so where you have to go you have to this is microsoft endpoint manager and you have to go to this uh, devices section here and go to the I ios and ipad os and you see here everything is related if you want to do anything with the, your ios devices here update policy for ios and ipad so what you have to do you have to just create one policies and this is only applicable if your devices has been supervised so supervised means through uh, either through apple configurator or through the apple business manager over there so so you can say update device ios 2 to whatever i like 15.16.2 or uh, 16.2 sorry 16.2 which is latest operating system okay uh, and just use uh, see update policy setting so you have to create a uh, profiles to force and assign devices so automatically install the latest these settings determine how and when software deploy updates this profile doesn't prevent user from updating so this profile actually it will not it will not prevent users from updating the os manually they can do uh, whenever they want manually which can be prevented up to 90 days with the device configuration restrictions policy update will only apply to devices enrolled through apple automated device enrollment with abm or apple school manager so you see here the update will only apply to the devices enrolled through if you want to learn more you just click on learn more and you will see um, select versions to install so the version of the install at the time of update which update so i have created for 16.2 which is actually latest available so if you want to patch like if you find some bug or vulnerability in this version you can use this one so whatever um, you can select it here or you can always get the latest update like 16.3 or whatever so i am selecting 16.2 if you have requirement you can select 16.1 whatever you are. since you selected the earlier version make sure you apply the device restriction policy that differ the visibility of the software update so that devices aren't updated okay so update policy schedule time now what is the update time update the next second update during schedule time if you want to schedule or update outside of schedule time so i whatever your requirement i am selecting updated next second but if you want to do on schedule time you can do outside or within schedule time select next i am default scope you can select it and you want to assign to selected groups you have to select the groups or you can assign to all devices or all users whatever you want if you want to exclude some of the groups or your devices you can ex also exclude just create this policy and you are ready to go so as soon as this uh, policy uh, will check in the devices will check in the update will be forced as per your policy and this will only be applied through uh, if your device is supervised through apple business manager so i hope you have learned how you can uh, create and update the policy how you can create the policy to update your own and patch your devices fully through apple um, business manager if it's enrolled so so this is the first requirement so devices has to be supervised if it's unsupervised of course this policy won't take effect and you'll see the time zone and everything it will show here as soon as it will run. 
I hope you have learned how you can create the policy and fully patch your iOS devices. Till then, thank you. Have a good day. Bye-bye.